so let's try, uh, put a little bit of blue in here as well. I'm going to take a little bit of blue and maybe along this line, let's put some blue. And then I'm going to go into some green. Again, I'm not following any pattern. I'm just doing whatever I want on this. I'm not actually even looking at the last butterfly I did. This is just so much fun. I'm going to end up with some more red. I'm going to go into some red. Just on that tip there. Just a little bit there. See how pretty that is? Okay, so we're going to go do that on this side. Blue. And then we're going to go into some green. Isn't that pretty? My goodness, that's pretty. And then I'm going to go grab just a little bit of red before that white gets covered up there. Just like that. Wow. What a kaleidoscope of colors. Isn't that so beautiful? Let's go ahead and put some yellow and green in this area. I'm going to start with some yellow again and then go into some green this time. And then I'm going to end up with some blue. How about that? Every one of them are different. And if I want to smooth it out a little bit, I can dip into water and just smooth it out. I'm going to uh, do the other side the same. Start off with some yellow and then go into the green and then some blue. Like that. And then if you want to smooth it out a little bit, dip your brush into the water. This is, well, be careful because the water will be just swooped up by the silk. And so don't have too much water in your brush or else it will go over those boundaries, those barriers. Okay. I blended that. Isn't that pretty? Let's do the last one, kind of like we did the first one, with some yellow and some orange. And before that gets away from us, some red. And I'm going to just blend that a little bit. And then do the other side the same thing. Yellow. And then some orange and some red. And then blend them. Wow. <laughs> let's keep going down here with the blue. And then we're gonna go, let's do, we haven't used purple yet, so let's go into some purple. And then let's quickly go into some red. Like that. Okay, whatever we do on this side, we have to do on the other side. So let's do that. Okay, so we start with the blue. We dipped into the purple. And then quickly grab some red before that gets all the way over. There we go. Just like that. I think I'm going to do the last one the same way. We're going to dip into the blue and then the purple. See how we're just working our way around that color wheel? Again, just to remind you, this is what we call analogous colors next to each other on the color wheel. Blue purple, and into the red. Mm -hmm. 